Hello and welcome to a Minecraft tutorial. This tutorial is on the plugin cooldowns. Start off by downloading the file and placing it in your plugins folder. Then open up the config with Notepad. The first part of the config you'll see that it cancels the warm up on certain things. And then the second part is the commands. This is the bit that we'll mainly look at. As you can see, you set the different commands that you want to use, such as home and spawn. Don't really know what these bits do, so I delete them. I really just know how to use the first bit, but deleting this doesn't seem to affect it and it works perfectly. So I just delete price 2, price 3, price 4, and price 5. As you can see, you type in the commands here, so you've got slash spawn, and the cooldown is 60, slash home, and the cooldown is 30. And then if you look at prices, you can see that spawn costs 10 and home costs 20. So you can just configure these and add more, but make sure you just do it with spaces and not tabs, otherwise the file doesn't work. So I'll just add a warm up for slash home. So the warm up is two seconds. Then I can change the prices if I wanted to, or I can just leave it and save the file. So I'll quickly start up my server, log in on Minecraft. Now if I do spawn, you can see $10 was taken from my account. If I try it again, it says I've got to wait 52 seconds. And then if I do home, you'll see that the warm up's 2 seconds. And then it's teleported me and it says that it's taken $20 out of my account. So you can see that the warm ups and cool downs are working perfectly. So it's got another 20 seconds until I can use that, another 32 until I can use that one. I can see this plugin being implemented on loads of servers, it's really unique. The ability to set cooldowns and warm ups for commands, let alone charging for them, is just awesome. It just means that you can charge people for setting their homes and for warping to spawn. And it just means that you can set cooldowns so they can only go home every hour or however long you wanted. I mean you could you can obviously configure it however your server felt the need. And as you can see slash spawn just teleports me back to spawn again. So it's a really useful plugin. Thanks for watching. I hope this video has helped. If it has please remember to rate, subscribe and comment.